Revelation chapter 15. Hiya, I'm Lydia and I'm currently trying to read, and by trying I mean succeeding at, praise God, I am reading the entire Bible chapter by chapter, day by day until I get to the end of it. But I started in James, so I'm going to wrap around all as well. We're almost at the end though, we're halfway, over halfway through Revelation, which is so cool because I've never read it before now. And so that is just so great. Anyway, 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 too much exposition. Let's get into it. Ap Apocalypse. Revelation chapter 15. Seven angels with seven plagues. I saw in heaven another great and marvellous sign. Seven angels with the seven last plagues. Last, because with them God's wrath is complete. And I saw what looked like a sea of glass glowing with fire. And standing beside the sea, those who had been victorious over the beast and its image and over the number of its name. They held harps given them by God and sang the song of God's servant Moses and of the Lamb. Great and marvellous are your deeds, Lord God Almighty. Just and true are your ways, King of the nations, who will not fear you, Lord, and bring glory to your name. For you alone are holy. All nations will come and worship before you, for your righteous acts have been revealed. After this I looked, and I saw in heaven the temple, that is, the tabernacle of the covenant law, and it was opened. Out of the temple came the seven angels with the seven plagues. They were dressed in clean, shining linen, and wore golden sashes around their chests. Then one of the four living creatures gave to the seven angels seven golden bowls filled with the wrath of God, who lives forever and ever. And the temple was filled with smoke from the glory of God and from his power. And no one could enter the, enter the temple until the seven eight, wow, until the seven plagues of the seven angels were completed. That was almost a great read. Almost. Ah, I got too cocky at the end. Anyway, thank you so much for joining me today. Thank you for reading the Bible with me. And thank you for supporting this space which in which I hope to complete the Bible and I hope to bring you guys with me so that we can all grow in our faith. Regardless, God bless you and may he bless you today and tomorrow just in case I don't post. Bye!